Hi everybody, so we're doing another organic question, and that's a question 4, so this is 2006, question 4D, and you're asked to calculate a percentage of carbon by mass in methyl benzene. Now this is a tricky enough one, um, but it appears trickier than it actually is, I should say, okay, it's not actually that bad. So first up, we must figure out the mass of carbon, that's the molecular mass by the way, over the molecular mass of ben methyl benzene times 100, okay. Um, to give us our percentage. So let's find out um, what the story is with this. So methyl benzene, we draw that out. So methyl benzene means there's a benzene ring in it. So we put in a shape like this. It's an awful looking benzene ring, I know that. Okay, and I will put in my double bonds there. Okay, now there's a methyl group attached to us. So we attach a methyl group here. It doesn't matter which one. And you just write down CH3. Okay, we must figure out how many carbons and how many hydrogens are present total. So if we're doing that out, um, we can see that each point here equals a carbon atom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we have seven carbon atoms. Okay, so we know the molecular mass of carbon is 12. So 12 times, 12 times seven then. Okay, and again, we can just multiply this out now if you want all together. Okay, and we we'll get our 84 there. Now hydrogens. We can see automatically that we have three hydrogens over here. That's grand. Draw in the rest of them. So each point here can only take in one hydrogen because carbon only wants four bonds total. And if you draw in the hydrogen there, it will have four bonds. Okay. We can't draw any hydrogens over here because it already has four bonds. One, two, three, four. Okay. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hydrogens in total. Okay. So Hydrogen and molecular mass is 1 times 8 there. Okay, obviously it will give us our 8. So 84 plus 8 is going to give you around 92. So your total mass of um, your methyl benzene is 92. Now, the 92 here times 100 gives our percentage. Now we just find out the percentage of mass, a percentage um, of mass of um, carbon. So the carbon, the total mass of carbon out of all of this is 84. So I just put 84 over 92 and we multiply that by 100 and you'll see that the vast majority of this, so that's 91.3% of this, is going to be carbon. The remainder will be hydrogen. So 91.3% is carbon, the remainder hydrogen. Um, and that's it. That's all you have to do. You just have to be able to draw out your methyl benzene. And again, just draw out the benzene ring and throw in the methyl group. And we know methyl should be CH3. And we know for benzene that there should be one hydrogen on each of them. But just to be careful with this guy over here, that the uh, methyl group is already attached to us, so we do not put a hydrogen on it. You'll see a little asterisk over here on marking schemes. Um, so it'll be like this. That means if you used any other number other than 92, you're going to um, lose marks. You won't get the marks, full marks for us. So look guys, that's it for um for the question fours on organic chemistry. I hope you took something from it. All the best.